Hi everyone. Um, I think I live in a pretty cool place. I find it interesting and I thought I'd take you on a little walk just about a mile from my house um, and show you what uh, what I look at when I go for a walk. Hope you enjoy it. Well, this road here is uh, Key Lane. It was a tiny little road when I was a boy. It's got quite busy now. There's industrial estate on the left hand side. The boatyard at the bottom. It's the mud flats, these get completely covered by water when the tide comes in. It's a little boatyard I spoke of. It's busier every time I see it. This is the back the back end of Portsmouth Harbour. It's uh, used for storing retired warships a couple more there Type 42 destroyers one of them was HMS Newcastle I'll, I'll forget the other one I'm going to walk along the shore here with my dad there he is This also gets covered completely at high tide. You can't walk along this shore. The place is strewn with wrecks. A popular place for dog walkers. Nice to see he's got his poop bag with him. Birds on the mud flats. This ring bolt was um, was used to haul broken ships, boats up this slipway. They would have been broken up on the foreshore here, um, and the wood carried off up the up that alleyway there, up that slipway. There was an old wood yard just opposite. This was March. These two guys walking around with with next to nothing on. And there's the reason they're swimming. Crazy. I used to do that. This hard standing was put here during the Second World War. It's a bollard used for mooring the boats that uh, departed from here for D-Day. You see those two lines of stumps there in the mud. They're obviously the uh, what remains of a wooden warship. Once again it would have been pulled up there and the wood taken away and reused. In the distance there you can see Portchester Castle, Norman Castle. Obviously being called Portchester it was it was obviously a, a Roman settlement. Two more retired warships, uh, and I still can't remember their names. Fearless and intrepid. Known worldwide. Are they? Yeah. HMS Victory. She's not retired. It's the world's oldest serving warship. There's a snapshot of her in dry dock. A quick look back over what we've been looking at. Tide's well on its way in now, you can see. Mental note, I think I need to pan a bit slower if I do this. There we go. Off to the pub. I guess I need a bit of practice on uh, dubbing and uh, lining the sound up. Not quite right there, but... Well, you, you've got the picture. I enjoy walking up there. Um, hope you enjoyed watching. Bye.